Okay, Lynx Tail by Los Straight Jackets. Uh, I'm going to go over this instrumental, what I was just playing, and uh, just show you the chords and um, how to approach it. Okay, it's in the key of E major, and I have standard tuning. I'm playing an E major chord. And uh, this uh, four chord repetitive pattern. Uh, it goes like this. So that's an E major. I'll call that a D power chord with a second. And then an A major. And then you walk up the uh, A string from the first position. That's a B dominant seventh. And then so it goes like this. So you notice that uh, when I'm playing, I'm not just strumming the E major chord. You know what you can? Just strum the chords. A lot easier to do it that way. And that would be uh, like this. break in the middle, I'm going to play uh, A dominant seventh up here, and that's at the uh, fifth position. So you walk up 
from the A dominant seventh up to the B dominant seventh. So you notice I'm just keeping my fingers in the same position, but you just walk up the fretboard up here to the seventh and then back down to the fifth. And you have a whammy, use it. And then you do the same thing up here. Now, I'm playing a D dominant seventh, tenth fret, that's where my index finger is. So again, you just walk up, and then this time I'm walking up here to the twelfth uh, fret. Now this part here, I played it different uh, because I wanted to. I'm just playing a D, no, excuse me, a B dominant seventh. I think I added a fourth in there for some reason. And then you go back down to this four chord thing. Again, if you have a whammy, uh, use it. Okay, I'll just uh, play it slow tempo. And to give it some variation, I played it here. So this here is just a uh, an E major. And then down to a D major. Same chords, just a different position. Okay, the uh, effects I was using. Okay, first off, you have to have reverb, of course. I added a little bit of, I guess you call it slapback echo. Sounds like this. That's just one effect right now, the delay. And I'll turn that off. Dry signal. Okay, and then uh, tremolo. So that's uh, three things. Start out with a dry signal. Reverb. Okay, the uh, slapback echo. And then tremolo. That's how I got the sound.
Okay, that's all for this lesson. I hope you enjoyed it, and thanks for watching. Bye.